Aries, let's do something different. Let's do something fresh. Because you got the fresh summer face. Like, you, if you got long hair, it's like the wet look, the fresh curly look. You know, like you're fresh out the shower. Fresh, we got moisturizer on there or something like that. Like, you got the summer dewy look. Even the men got the fresh face. Like, you might have trimmed your beard or something like that, where it just looks, everything is fresh and sharp and, <sighs> I need something new. So, Aries. Let's see, what, let's see what you want to talk about today. But more so what you need to know. What's up, guys? Welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. I'm a century park star. Okay. And we're going to see what comes out in Aries reading. Keep in mind, if it resonates, leave with this not. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. You and your cool ass energy. A century. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I don't know what wants to come out. I can tell you lie. What was that song? Stutter, stutter, you stutter. Uh, whoever sang that song was it Joe? Cause you're ticking me off. Cause you're ticking me off. Something like that. I hear it so long, but I hear it pop playing in my head. We have the Ten of Pentacles. I'm wondering where we getting all this money from. I don't know where we, how we affording all this stuff. Somebody found out some deep dark secrets because the, the under the card underneath the overall tone is the Eight of Cups. So somebody's walking away from a picture perfect storefront because they don't know how how you keeping things up. Okay, there's not enough money floating around for what we got going on in here. I don't know. Five of Cups, Aries, you sad, or somebody said that you found out. They regret that you found out. So they having Sunday dinners with you like this, but they really got something else going on. Maybe. Or if this is work, you found out you've been replaced, something like that, and you're sad, or it's is creating a depression because it couldn't have happened at a worse time or you got something got deducted from you or you I feel like you got slighted you've been passed over that the transformation there's a change in the winds something's over Nine of Wands is really messing with you, though. I don't like how the, the, the deep impact it has on you with the Nine of Wands. I, in my, in my intuition, it felt really good to somebody to have seen you like this. This feels like what goes around comes around. But somebody is like wish fulfillment all day long about you going through this. Now see the four, this is the four of pentacles. Let's move this out of the way. Empress and the Magician. I know that my family is elsewhere. That's what I heard. And you're keeping it close to your chest too with the four pinnacles that you're moving away from. So you're walking away. This is creative energy. So whoever the woman of the house, there's something tied to the woman of the house. I don't like it. And it's something that's changed for you with the magician. It's like, you know, it's like, this is, 
It's almost like hermit energy too, but this is the creative side of Virgo or Gemini. Because you got you're trying to be innovative. You're trying to be you're trying to turn this turn your mood around. The mood is depressing. I don't like the mood in this house. It's depressing. Oh, I don't like the mood. It, I don't like the mood, my mood working here. It's depressing. Let me figure something else out. Or it's like you met this empress and she's like a goddess to you. And she's somebody you look up to and you see her basking and you like her aura is strong. And that's Libra. It's giving me Libra energy. And business is going well for this person. This is still independent energy. Like an empress can hold her own just like an emperor. Ultimately. And this is giving this person the motivation to do something different or go about things different, different. So the ancestors with the death card, it has ancestors on it. The death of transformation It's not death actually. It's more so evolving. Something, and something has to end for something to begin. And they go, your emperor. This transformed you into the emperor. You know yourself to be a certain way. So you got sick of this depressive mood. Like it was a mood, an energy it was in. It's like, now, I get, because you do have the five of cups and the eight of cups. They're starting off with the eight of cups. And then it moves back down to a five. Like you'll walk away. And then that old familiar feeling, it's like an appendix on your hand. I mean, it's like an appendix on your heart. Like you got to go back to that. You got to go back because that's home to you. That's That's been home to you for a long time. That way of doing things. And the nine of cups is going to end it off with the wish fulfillment. So you're, you're standing your ground for what you want. This just gives me fighter, fighter, not fight or flight, but uh, all things are possible when the most high is present in my endeavors. So once you start thinking and acting along those lines, you wish you start to align yourself with emotional fulfillment. And the three of cups is on the bottom. And so it's the six of wands. And you didn't have to do nothing rugged to get it because this is a two-headed doctor with the temperance. It's like we could do this the positive way or the street way. So something did shift, maybe professionally, that could have had an impact on a, a personal life or was the root, it was meant to happen. It was an ending. It caused an ending. So if something shifted in finances and did something that was already a depressing situation in your in other area, it's just like a domino effect. It's just spilled over in other areas of life. This person couldn't put nothing in your food to keep you there. And all it, ba it backfired on this person. So this person, the seven of swords, you see her, she's cooking. She's putting stuff in the food to keep her husband faithful. That's what she's doing, st using strategy and wit and deception, putting stuff in the food. So uh, by however way that resonates, this person couldn't do their old party tricks to get you to stay, but you were already in a depressed mood. So this eventually backfired, which caused something in the professional realm to deteriorate. So it caused a, a, a real strain in, the, in, the, in other areas of your life, could be your home life or just on your mood, your overall mental, because you're not happy. So it was just enough to destroy the prick the camel's back. So everything completely fell apart to be to build something new. That's what I'm getting. To get you to go down a different path. Page of Pentacles. And you didn't do any you didn't hurt anybody to do it. Like it was it was hard. 
like you was hard. You got a lot of stinginess. It caused a real rift in your chest that you went through that, that you were even experiencing that. You didn't know you was going to come out this trial all in one piece. Okay. Things were falling apart all around you and you managed and you didn't see the blessing in disguise, but it, it made you tap into your inner star player with the magician. The magician is in between the emperor and the empress. So you're going from that lackluster pinch and pennies energy to that abundant nine of cups energy. And I think it's a connection to your counterpart. You feel your counterpart progressing. Now it's pulling you. So you could have been in a four of pentacles energy, man or woman. And your counterpart is in that ten of pentacles energy, that wealthy energy, that family energy, that, that, that fulfilled energy. I have it all. I own it all. We own the night. I own the world. And you got that. What is this? The Knight of Wands and the Knight, Knight of Pentacles. You wanted, somebody wants to do a meet and greet with the family. Something's going to take off real fast and the meet and greet with the family. It's going to be nice. It's going to play out really good. So, am I supposed to know, boys? So what about the meet and greet? For right now, you get that 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 dark night of the soul, that shadow work that's taking a look at yourself. Take a look at everything around you. It's the death is fucking depressing. Dang. So you did something about it. You ain't have no choice. Everything fell apart for something to be built better with that Knights of Pentacles. And that Knight of Wands, it's like, it don't have to be boring. It doesn't have to be stiff. It doesn't have to be boring. And it's not with that Knight's that fresh energy, that vibrant youth, youth is not wasted on a young energy. So you're making, you're doing things your way. That's how your empress is doing it. And now you're doing it. Aries, Libra, Libra energy. And they go the knight of swords. That's the thing with y'all. Real catchy, witty, quick on your feet. You dig? You're you're high in demand. You understand your place in this world is not to be sitting around mundane, complaining or listening to somebody complain. Your purpose is to be out there amongst the people. The people need you. You're high in demand. You know that you're high in demand. So you gotta walk. You gotta fill the shoes. It's time to fill the shoes. It's not time to dick or mess around. I would say dick around. So you're getting out of that stagnant energy. You know what to do. You just didn't want to do it. Is that right, Aries? You are being stubborn. And look, the Six of Cups is on the bottom. My person made me do it. She just wouldn't get her foot off my ass until I did it. That's just the inspiration. So Aries, this is like a, a cliffhanger for what happens next. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Until next time.